like, wow, this is cool. I can't really see. It's like a really big house. It's actually very small. That's cool. Um, I'm Andy Wagner, and I'm the curator of the Leading Edge series. Um, I wish I could say it was my idea, but it wasn't. Um, so I really want to thank Natalia Mount and everybody at the Red House for having the gumption and, and being just uh, nutty enough to mount a new music series uh, in Syracuse. Um, I think it's a great idea, and I think it's going to be fabulous. We've already started planning uh, for next season. Um, that's how excited we are about it. And in the program, there's my little curator's note, a little blurb about the series. Um, and you'll notice that I was so excited about it that I, I went into kind of a wormhole. And I referred to planning is already underway for 08, 09. And it hit me today that this is, in fact, 08, 09. <laughs> so planning is, in fact, in effect for 09, 10. Um, we've even started talking about 10, 11. Um, the rest of the series uh, looks like this. And you can get a brochure like this and put it on your fridge. I have one on mine. And everything tastes better that comes out of that fridge. Um, on December 3rd, we have a, a, a fabulous young group from New York called Flexible Music. Um, they utterly bend and distort the boundaries between different genres, and they do it in a way that is really exciting and utterly convincing because they're such great players. So they do um, new music that sounds perhaps like many of our ideas of what new music sounds like, except uh, on steroids. And they do lots of music that is jazz-based and somewhat pop and world music-based, not unlike the program you're going to hear tonight, but with a, a, a very different edge. Um, and then in March, Sequitur, one of the premier new music uh, groups in New York that specializes in different forms of music theater. Uh, they're going to do a program here that uh, will include a piece of mine, actually, based on Shakespeare. It's kind of a big extravaganza with actors and ensemble and kazoos and Joshua Light Show. Um, then, at the end of the season in May, um, our group Open End, which some of you have heard, uh, but hopefully all of you will hear. Um, and we do lots of new music and also uh, free improvisation. So about a third of that concert will be improvised, um, which is kind of cool. You'll, you'll be at a concert with with five world premieres on it, two of them written out and three of them that don't exist yet. Um, next year looks great with ensembles from Norway and other groups from New York, and it just keeps on coming. And I think this is the perfect venue for something like this. You can really get up close and personal, meet the performers over a, an espresso after the concert. It's, it's all very funky but very civilized. So we're really excited to have you here. And without further ado, I'd like to introduce Neil Rolling. <laughs> 